be ready 5 seconds many congratulations to all of you you have returned after doing a great job for humanity the entire team associated with operation dost be it ndrf army air force or other services has done a wonderful job even our voiceless friends the members of the dog squads have shown amazing ability the country is very proud of all of you our culture has taught us vasudhaiva kutumbakam people with a broad mind do not differentiate for them the universe is a big family so everybody belongs to one family and they serve only living beings considering them as their own be it turkey or syria the entire team has manifested these indian values in a way we consider the whole world as one family if there is any crisis on any member of the family then it is india's duty to provide immediate help to him irrespective of the country if it is a matter of humanity and human sensitivity then india keeps human interest paramount what matters the most is how quickly the help is extended during natural calamity there is a term golden hour used during an accident similarly there is golden time during natural calamity how quickly the support team arrives the swiftness with which you reached there after the earthquake in turkey has attracted the attention of the whole world it demonstrates your preparedness and the efficiency of your training the way you worked there for 10 days with full devotion is really inspiring we all have seen those pictures when a mother was blessing you by kissing your forehead or when an innocent life buried under the debris was in smiles again due to your efforts in a way you were also exposed to death there in the rubble but i would also say that the whole country was brimming with pride with every picture coming from there along with professionalism the spirit of human sensibilities by the indian team is incomparable it matters even more when a person is going through trauma or when someone is trying to regain consciousness after losing everything the sensitivity with which the army hospital and its personnel worked in such circumstances is also commendable the one who can help himself is self sufficient but when someone is able to help others he is selfless this applies not only to individuals but also to nations over the past few years india has strengthened the identity of selflessness 
along with self-sufficiency. Wherever the Indian teams reach with the tricolor, people are assured of help and of improvement in the situation. As you cited the example of Syria, when an Indian tricolor atop a box got upside down and one of the citizens there rectified it and claimed proudly that he thanked India with respect. We saw the same role of the tricolor in Ukraine some time ago. India's tricolor became a shield for Indian citizens as well as people from many countries who were being evacuated from there. Operation Ganga set a great example by becoming a hope for all. We brought back our loved ones safely from Afghanistan in very adverse circumstances under Operation Devi Shakti. We saw the same commitment during the Corona global pandemic. India took the initiative to bring back each and every citizen from foreign countries in that uncertain environment. We also helped many people from other countries. India also provided essential medicines and vaccines to hundreds of needy countries of the world. As a result, there is goodwill towards India across the world today. Operation Dost also reflects India's dedication to humanity and our commitment to immediately help countries in distress. India is found ready as a first responder wherever there is a disaster in the world. India was the first to come forward to help, be it earthquake in Nepal, crisis in Maldives or Sri Lanka. Now, apart from the country, the trust of other countries is increasing on the Indian forces as well as the NDRF. I am happy that NDRF has built a very good reputation among the people of the country over the years. The people of the country feel confident whenever there is any crisis or a cyclone and act in accordance with you. There is a sense of hope and faith among people when you and your colleagues in NDRF uniform reach any disaster hit region, whether it is a cyclone, floods or earthquake. This in itself is a great achievement. When sensitivity and human face is added to skills of a force, then the strength of that force increases manifold. I would especially appreciate NDRF for this remarkable feat. The country is confident about your preparations. But we don't have to stop here. We have to increase our relief and rescue capacity in times of disaster. We have to strengthen our identity as the best relief and rescue team in the world.